Glory be to God. Hallelujah. We thank the Lord Jesus Christ. We glorify him. We honor him for his goodness and his mercy. As Michael Almighty, as we said, today is 11th, the 9th, and the 28th. The 2018, sorry, 2018. I do this for a reason, people of God. You see, I bless the name of the Lord God Almighty because I was about to speak about something and the Lord just said to me, you better speak about this now. Glory be to God. Thank you, God. You see, my God Almighty, many people don't seem to understand the, what, or the blessing it is. What a blessing it is for, for each and every one to have somebody that is watching over them. People don't understand it. Many people don't get it. Many people look at it as nothing. And I know many people take this empowerment line for granted. Many people come on this empowerment line and they take it for granted. They, they, you know, and, 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 and I bless God because you know what happened, people of God? I thank God for the person that God have me to be today, today, today. I'm a people person. From I was born, I was born this way. One of you all hear me. I was born to be a people person. I was born to love people. You know, sometimes, you know, sometimes, um, let me tell you something. The way my heart is to people, I'm going to explain a little something. And it's not about me. I'm just bragging in the Lord. I'm just glorifying God. It's not about me, people. I don't take the glory. I, I will not try to take the glory of my Buddha no, no, no way. The way my heart is, let me tell you something. If somebody, like when I said I used to go to school for my young girl and I used to fight and never lose a fight. But in the midst of me, people of God, as soon as I fight somebody, I start to feel sorry for them. Always. How do you all hear me? I said, as soon as I fight somebody and even beat them up, I start to feel sorry for them and because I two things I used to do, I used to bring them down on their knee and I strip them naked. I always do that. I used to bring them on their knee and strip them naked. And when I, I remember one day I, I beat this girl and I tore her clothes so much. And you should see me running from one yard to the other looking pin to help her pin up her clothes because I felt sorry for her. And I tell her I'm sorry. And believe me, people of God, did you know that after that, that girl talked to me? Because, you see, God, God has created me in a way to have an heart of compassion for people. Amen. And when you have the heart of compassion, you need to understand. I am not trying, listen to this, I am not trying to intimidate nobody to come on this line to for me to be no spiritual person over them or what have you. No, I don't do that. I'm not trying to stop people from going to their church. But look at the blessing. The things that I'm doing to many people on this empowerment line, your very pastor is not doing it. Come on, talk to me. If you all could admit it, this is this is the Lord of me speaking, not me speaking this of my own. It's true, it's true, it's true. The things that I'm doing towards people, believe me, I need for, I need for, um, Sister Siobhan, find for me where Paul said the Apostle, you're breaking up, you're breaking up, Apostle. Oh, Jesus, help us, God. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Can you hear me clearly now? Yes, yes. Okay, I guess I cannot use no single phone because this, the system is just taking tone. Anyway. What I'm trying to say, people of God, what was what was I speaking, Sister Gay? How did you all hear me? When, what's her name called to me? You were going to tell me to find the scripture. Okay, find that scripture for me. The more, I, the more I love, Paul said it, the more I love, the less. Find it for me. People, people of God, what I want to say to you all, you see, many people say they have somebody cover over them. But let me say this to you all, and this is no joke thing. 
I'm going to use this and I'm not going to apologize. Woe be unto pastors that have sheep and not keeping them covered under the, the, the glory of God. Woe be unto them. You all don't get it. Let me tell you something, people of God. You all don't understand. I am asking God not to have me too busy so that I don't remember to pray for everybody. Not to have me too busy. So that I don't remember to pray for everybody. I want you all just hear what I just said. Because people of God, when I'm, I, I remember when, I, when I'm traveling like on a plane and so forth. I try my best. I force myself not to sleep. I force myself not to sleep. The only thing, I, when they come, I, oh, do you want to watch movies and so forth? I said, I said, I'm very sorry, but it is right in my hand. Thank you very much. This, the B-I-B-L is my movie. Thank you very much, my dear. That's what I said to them. Because they see me with the Bible and asking if I want to watch a movie. That's the devil right there. Talk to me. So what I'm trying to say, people of God, when I'm traveling, two things I do. I read the Bible and I pray. That's all I do. Amen. You hear what I'm saying? And when I'm praying, people of God, let me say this to you. Whenever I am praying, my heart of compassion rise up for everybody that I can imagine or think of. That's how I am. What I'm trying to say, people of God, Many of you, my God Almighty, out there have people that are um, pastors for your all name it. And somebody's moving up stuff. Please, please, let us not have disturbance like Wednesday. Wednesday was very nasty and dirty. When the message come out, you all will hear it because I, I don't know how to split anything. So Wednesday, you're going to hear whatever. Anyway. As I said, people of God, many people, they have a pastor, they have even a bishop, whoever name it. But it is just, it's like, it's like a good name to many. It is like a good name. Because you all, if you all could only see and know. You see, when you have, when you have, when you have children of the Most High God, as the Lord God Almighty said in, in Jeremiah, not in Jeremiah, in the, in, in, Jeremiah, yes, in Jeremiah 24, as he speak about the sheep and name it and what of you, people of God. It must be for each and every shepherd must able to cover their children. I mean, look at this. Many of you come on this empowerment line, you have your church, but still yet, just to know that you come and make up, whether, whether you come to, 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 to worship God and make up numbers. Because some of you, only making up numbers. This is no joke thing. I have to speak it. And I'm not going to apologize saying it. Who the cap fit, let them wear it. If you know that you're not making up number, I'm not talking to you. But some of you that come on this line, my God Almighty, your worship, name it and what of you, you have your church. Some of you will even make, let it be known that I have my church. I have hear people talk all the time, especially when we're talking about giving and support and pe people want to say whatever. They make it known that they have their church. Look. This woman of God is not pulling away nobody from their church. I am for the whole wide world. Listen to me. Just like how you would have um, churches where you would say, this church is this, this church is that, 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 that. I am, for the, I am for the Lord Jesus Christ. Christ died for the world. I am living for the world. And I'm not living for the world to live and be like the world. I am living to pray for God's people until the Lord God Almighty do whatever I have to do for my life. This is how I'm going to remain because this is my calling. This is what I, I, I was called to be. This is what God created me to be. Jesus Christ is staying in the garden. He pray, my God Almighty as often as he can. He was praying for everybody. He wasn't just praying for one set of people. He was praying for everybody. So what I'm trying to say, my God Almighty, I am here for everybody. When people don't remember me, I do remember them. Why? Because it is a calling on my life. That's the office I'm sitting in. 
because I am sitting in that office and I know people of God, you all don't understand. I have made so many sacrifices to live this life. When I said sacrifice, I have denied the things of the world to, to, to do the work of God. Amen. I have denied working a secular job. I'm, I, I'm not working on so many I would say 16 years now, I'm not doing any work with anybody out there. 16 long years. Yeah, yeah. I am not working with anybody out there. I only depend on the Lord Jesus Christ. And I do this not to get, not to gain money, but to gain the power of the Lord Jesus Christ. So that when I open up my mouth, power can come to your all life. Yeah, ba 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 ba. Shake it, Obo Sanya. People receive the power. Let it work, man. Let it work. I wonder if you all understand what I'm saying. So, I just want to fix some people' mind. When some of you come on this line and you hear about, oh, it's the woman' birthday coming up. Oh. Um, do, would you like to bless the ministry? Now look at it. Let me say this to you all. Many of you are holding back on your blessing. And God want me to speak this. You know why I'm saying this? If you're in a church, even if you, oh. vis even if you visit a church, they're going to ask you to throw an offering. If you are coming on this empowerment line every time the line open, and you're only asked to just bless the ministry. Mark, nobody don't put no gun on you and say, give this, give that. Nobody don't put you in no... A ten dollar line, twenty dollar line, thirty dollar line, forty dollar line, fifty dollar line, hundred dollar line, name it. Nobody don't put you in those kind of line just to bless the ministry. And you looking and say, Oh, I'm not gonna do it. I I'm, I'm, I have my church. Oh, me? And the Lord show me that many people do this because they don't many people keep their mouth shut on the line because they don't want to be occupied for nobody to really hear them and know them. they just come to enjoy the blessing. And no problem with that. But all I'm saying, when you're in the midst where the Holy Spirit is moving. Join in and do your best because what? That is all you're going to get your breakthrough. Amen. What I'm trying, what I'm trying to say, people, but I'm not about talking about money. But what I'm talking about mainly, the main thing I'm talking about is to have. I think I teach something about a, having a spiritual covering. Somebody covering over your life. But what I'm saying, people of God, I am just trying to express right at this moment the importance of a person that God put in the midst to cover somebody, to cover people, to cover sheep. When you're covering somebody, you cannot, my God Almighty, be about me, myself, and I. It's not God you're working with if you're like that. Because you see what? What I have to understand, I have to understand that I, that I take up a mantle to work for the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. Amen. And that is what you all need to understand. Because I am doing things like this, what you think God do? God will bring whoever, I don't have to know none of you, but God will bring you all, whoever, in the midst so that I can able. And I get it in the spirit that Donal was praying and praying for God, God, let the prayer of the woman of God work for my mother. Let the, the woman of God remember my mother. He was praying and name it and what of you. And because of his heart, God bring him to me in the spirit. Look at that. Amen. That's right. Glory be to God. You all don't get it yet. The Bible said, people of God, a clean hands and a pure in heart shall see God. Sister Shavan, you see, you see, um, you get the scripture. That's it. That's it. That's it. The more, the more, listen to me. And let me tell you something, people of God. No devil from the pit of hell can stop me from loving God's people. The love that I have, listen to me. The more I love God's people is the more Christ shine in me. I want to all get what I'm saying. The more I love God's people, and listen to me, 
Remember, I have many families. I have a big family. Oh, you know, I have um, um, five, five of us as, as sisters and maybe four brothers, even more, because I take on to me sister, my sister Denise and sister Merlin have, have a different set of family. I take on to them as family too. And I pray that when the Lord gives me that okay, I'm able to meet with them and, you know, I welcome them in my family as well because that's about that's me people of God I don't like I don't divide I'm not in the division thing I'm talking about loving people that you know are attached to the family everyone must be loved amen, amen. Oh. glory be to God hallelujah so what I'm saying people of God Rabba Satoria 